I wanted to show you what I did with the little cabinet that I bought at Sweet Pickens from uh, the Cranky Queen, and I love it. Absolutely love it. I, I didn't know really what to put in it, but Amy had, had ordered me these for part of my Christmas, and I love, you know, the same. And then just a little trinket box. And then here's two of my nativities that I like. And um, Amy put the little ornament there that Mason had made in Sunday school. Hold on, let me let Scout back in the house. And then on the bottom, I just have a, a milk jug of old wooden spoons. And I think I got might have gotten it there or at Sammy's, I'm not sure. This is the bouquet that I carried in Chris's wedding. And that was me when I was a little girl. Oh, I wish the light wasn't on it. One Christmas morning. And up on top, I just have uh, some of my iron stone. I had, had gotten these two creamers. They have the green ring around them. I had ordered those uh, from someone on Instagram. And then this tea towel is pretty special. I bought it at... Uh, the Cotton Picking Festival over at the Old Baker Farm. And the reason it's special to me, one of Harold's uh, cousins who has passed away, his wife made or embroidered all, uh, just all kinds of tea towels and her daughter was selling them for her. And I loved you know, the old rocking chair and everything, but just to know that Bobby had made it was pretty special. I like the, the cabinet open, but you can remember, well, I've got it, that on that side, but I love the chippiness of the, of the old cabinet. And you know, I told you Harold would probably think I was crazy for buying something that is really old and um no there's no telling how old but he likes it and you know i'm gonna treasure it and take good care of it i had to move one of my bird lamps from this table but that's okay and y'all all of these books right here i think they're on my Amazon store, but the author is a cousin of mine, and I just, all of her books are so, so good, and she tells the story so that you never want to, you don't want it to end, but Valerie's last story is about her grandmother, who is, oh, I'm trying to think, my grandfather and her daddy were brothers. So, um, it's about her and I loved reading it. But, um, turning slowly, we'll be opening presents. I've got some out here. Amy bought this cute little sleigh at a thrift store yesterday it's hers but you know they're living out here right now so i just put some gifts in it and love it but i i moved my other bird lamp over there and uh it's just you know it's just my things that i love out here it may not be what you like but I definitely like it, and I'm so thankful that I was able to purchase this cabinet because I really do love it. But I'll show you some other things a little bit later. I hope that y'all um, have had a good day, 
and remember to be salt and light wherever you are.